my bay, I think. All right, Kate. And before noon. We're not sleeping on it. What's going on guys? Welcome back to another YouTube video on today's episode of whatever this channel is that I'm doing. We are going to do fender exits. I was kind of on the fence about it, but I've been practicing my stainless welding and I've decided that I'm going to do the fender exits. These are nice enough, I think, for me having been done by me they're nice enough to go on the car i'm happy with the way that they've come out so i'm going to take off this side and we're going to work on doing the um the pie cuts and routing um this exhaust out this fender over here i do have a manual masters uh manual brake cylinder for this to get to make a little bit more room but that side will be a little more interesting We'll see what we're gonna have to figure out. I'm gonna move the fuel pressure regulator and all that other stuff. This might be a more than uh, one part video just cause this is probably gonna take me a little while, but we'll, uh, <clears throat> I'm definitely doing it. I'm not sleeping on it. Sorry, I'm not sleeping on it. like that hot sides off well first pieces well that's a bright light but first pieces mock uh on there the one that i practiced on earlier and i think that i'm gonna run right here this next piece i'm gonna try to get as close as i can and still maintaining a little bit of clearance to this um strut tower but i'm gonna want to try to stay away from i'm gonna basically try to be splitting the difference between the valve cover and this uh strut tower but I'm gonna swing it with this. I'm gonna, this piece. I'm gonna swing it down a little tiny bit to clear this the ground, the factory ground location there. I'm gonna swing it down just a little bit, and also with this other pie cut, keep it kind of away from the valve cover. I'm gonna start working it back towards the strut tower. But I'm gonna get this tacked on, and then we're gonna work on the next piece. This is just a, like a piece that I had laying around from somebody else's car, but it is nice and straight cut on the end of it. So I am using it to kind of mock up. So I, that's about what I'm thinking right there. This is just gonna be a straight piece and then it'll be right about the height that I want it. Uh, and then I'm gonna start using the pie cuts to get it to turn out, but I'm gonna cut a piece that's the right length of uh, some nice fresh stainless and then we'll get this one tacked on too. I gotta wear headphones so I don't get copyrighted but I like I can't not listen to music while I'm in here doing stuff and it being too quiet in here drives me nuts. But we're making progress. So we got you know quite a bit of it tacked up here. Got uh, some more marked. I'm gonna keep working here. Get some more of them tacked on here and uh, looking good thank i want to say thanks to there's a couple of people i want to say thanks to first um Siley always he's you know putting up with my crap all the time bugging him like asking him how to do stuff jason brazel also um all the welding questions i've had three people that come to mind jason brazel four people come to mind uh my cousin sarah Sai over at Lee Tuning and Racing, and Jason over, uh, B Jason over at BPF, and Keith Townsend, my buddy back in Omaha. I've been like constantly, constantly messaging those those four people about you know what can I do? Here's what's happening. You know I run into issues with this welding stuff, and like they they've set me straight uh, more times than I could say. So thanks to those four people. You guys are awesome. I appreciate you guys putting up with my BS, and uh, we'll, we'll keep plugging away here though. We got everything tacked up. I'm probably gonna start, see if I can't knock out maybe half of these tonight. 
it's pretty late it's like it's getting close to one o'clock so i'm gonna have to probably call it a night here in a little bit but um i'm gonna tack these up so uh if you guys want to watch the time lapse of this video go ahead i'm gonna do a throw a time lapse in after this otherwise thanks for watching sticking around i appreciate it and uh, comment like subscribe share with your friends do whatever i appreciate the support everybody that's been watching my videos it's awesome to see like all my friends and family and everybody like that that have been supporting me and so thanks a lot um but enjoy this time lapse and we'll see you guys next time.